Okay, boys and girls. <coughs> this is one of them rare days. Thank you, sir. Uh, in February, where we're going to be able to go out deep. And right now, 29.2 miles is how far out we're going. We hope. God willing, that's right. So, let's button down the hatches, zip up the coats, let's go out there. <laughs> All right, we've had a little change of plan, folks. Uh, these waves, it was supposed to be kind of flat today, and it, it is not flat. So we're going to hang out a little bit at one of these natural reefs for a while. Or, yeah, natural, natural bottom. And if it flattens out, then we'll go back out. We'll go out further, try to get in 100 feet of water. That's, that's my goal today is to try to get out in 100 feet. Boat's never been out in 100 feet of water. So that's the goal. We'll get back to you at David over there and the yellow angler. Looks like we got some real current going on here too. All right, we'll get back to you in a bit. All right. The depth here is 80 feet. Water temperature is 67.5, so it's, call, it's cooled down about 5 degrees since last week when we came out. Current is really strong. All I'm doing is trying to get bait right now. There's my first little ruby lips bait. I'll get about four or five of these, and then I will begin getting serious about fishing. Yeah, they're, they're cold. They are a little bit cold right now. So, I don't need nav on, I need the aerator. Uncle John's got a line puller here, pole bender. I don't think that's a black sea bass, John. <laughs> I don't think that's a black sea bass, my friend. We're out here where we caught those black sea bass last time. Let me see what this is. That's a big fish. I'm sure it bit their big red snapper, probably. Probably. Come on. You can do it. Oop, there's some more bait for me. Let's hope we don't attract too many sharks. There's some big ones out here, boys and girls. Big sharks. Oh, I see him. That's about a 25-inch red snapper. Woo -doo -doo. <laughs> oh, yeah, nice one, John. Nice one. But, you know, you can't keep them. They're still illegal to keep. Got to throw them back. Black sea bass at one time. Wow. Big John. Woo. Praise the Lord. Oh, it's about 14, 15 inches. Golly. Well, something going on here. I don't know what it is on my little sabiki. John just caught a about two 14 inch black sea bass up there. I was pulling this up and something came up. Oh, a couple of mackerel. All right, there's some bait. Oh, a blue and a mackerel. Huh? A blue and a mackerel. Blue fish. Blue runner and a mackerel. Blue runner. Oh, that's good bait. Look at there. I'll throw this. Uh, Blue runner up to you. I'm gonna let that mackerel go because I don't like them. I don't like them. No way, Big John again, being a pest, being a pain. A ton of algae or something in the water. Isn't yeah, it? I know. Okay, I got something here. Not too big. You got two red, two red snapper this time. A little bitty baby one. Wow. You got two red snapper this time. I think I got on this shrimp. I think I just got a grunt. Yeah, that's all right. I'm still trying to catch some bait on the old sabiki. And this is a trigger fish called little trigger fish. Got to throw the trigger fish back. Got yourself a red snapper now, John? I do. I'm gonna have to throw them back, you know. Like that. Uh. 
it's not a black sea bass. It's just a big old snapper. Look at him. Hold on. <laughs> oh, man. He was holding on for dear life. Oh. So far, John got two for the cooler. Salty kayak got Zippo. So John's my hero already. Two black sea bass and one sabiki. That's unbelievable. That's aggravating. That's what that is. Oh, looks like I caught my own line. Or I caught somebody's line. Had somebody's line. I got off. He's hooked in the side of the mouth. On the outside of the mouth. He's not even huge. This current's so strong. There we go. That was on a bare hook. Let me throw You're that good. in. You're really good. <laughs> yeah. You want me to throw that in the cooler for you, John? Uh, yeah, let's, let's do one. Okay. Let me throw that back up there for you. Yep, you, a lot of work to, to put into it, though. Golly, there must be a lot of them down there. There you go. You're crazy. He's crazy. All right, this red snapper is 20 to the fork, but a fat, he is a fat 20. You got one up there, John? Okay. Red snappers everywhere. Grunt and Brother John says it feels a little red. I don't know how it can feel red when you. Well, I guess I, I guess I guess you know. If it looks, if it feels red and it looks red, it is red. Red snapper on the old Sabiki again. Old Big John gets a reel burner here, a pole bending reel burner. What you got there, big guy? Does it feel red? Yeah. Oh, it feels red, he says. There he is out there. It's big and red. That's a pretty nice one, about 18, about 18 to 19 incher. Nice one, nice one. It's kind of red. I'm not sure though. Kind of strange looking. Come on up here. Let me see you. Yeah, big old red snapper. Got him in the lip. Got him on the lip. A lip gripper. Got another 20 incher. They're all over the place out here. <clears throat> we have moved out to a new spot a little bit further. I'm about another six miles out. We're still only at 85 feet. Water temperature is only 68 degrees, so I don't think we're going to get any cobia. We're just trying to get away from the red snappers out here. And that's not a red snapper. That's a keeper black sea bass, Big John. Number three for you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Wow. Way to go. What'd you catch him on? Grunt tail. Grunt tail. Oh, boy. All right. This is my first fish out here at this new area. I think we're about 20-some miles out. There's a couple boats out here. It's a kind of a popular area. Let's yeah, see what we got. I hope it's I hope it's not a red snapper. I can't get away from them. It is a <laughs> dang gone. John, I can't get away from them. I'm serious. On shrimp, on on anything. These things are just everywhere. Mm-mm. -mm. Ooh. Yeah, black sea bass just sit down there when they get their, their food in their mouth. They just sit there. Yeah. What you got? What you got, big guy? Oh my! What have I got? What the heck? Is, oh, I think I got you. Got a black sea bass, and I think I got Mr. Bottom here. Oh, there we go. Small black sea bass. I think you're gonna be too small. Oh, at least another structure down there. All right, this is a something on a <clears throat> couple of shrimp that I caught the other night. Let's see what we got. That 
too big. Could be a black sea bass. If it is, he's not big enough. Nope, another red snapper. <laughs> oh man. Oh. Let's cut him on the edge of the lip too. Little guy. Oh you know, beautiful day. Always something good about the day when you're fishing. I got something. It's got some real bones in it. And there's some structure down there. I don't want him to get in. Oh, I lost him. Came off, John. That was something nice. Uh. All right, here we go, here we go. Let's see if we can get this guy up. All right, then get something here I can use the neck on. Before. I know. Huh? Yeah, isn't that true? Yeah. Come on, come on up here. Ah. And all the structure around the bottom here, you got, oh, broke me off. Got in a hole. Again? Broke me off. Uh. Whoa! I think he got the whole thing too. He got in a, in a shelf down there and broke me off. Mm -mm -mm. Whoa, he is down in a hole. Down in a hole. Oh, I can feel it rubbing. Oop. Either broke me off or got off. Boy, these guys are smart. <laughs> They've been through the party. They've, yeah, they've, they've been through the party. Hardy. Broke me off, yep. John just caught a vermilion, and I just caught a big vermilion. I mean, a nice big vermilion. He must be 14 or so. That's worthwhile. Yeah, he's 15. If I were to pinch the tail, it'd be 16. Wow. Thank you, Lord. That's, that is a nice big fatty. Sardine. Circle hook in the side of the lip. There's a lot of big fish down here, folks. A lot of big fish. John's up on me probably about six fish now. That's the first one I've caught that I can put in the cooler. Thank you, Lord. All right, I'll put him in there. There's Big John again, showing off. He's got a, he's got, ooh, hey, I'm gonna get in a bite, on your old circle hook. Ah, got him. That last vermilion was so big, I thought it was a red snapper. You got red snapper and a grunt. You had to say the word. Dude. Yeah. <laughs> you had to say that, Master. Yeah, I know. All right, this does not feel like a red snapper. This looks like a red snapper. You had to say the bad word. I know, I said the bad word. Red snapper. Throw them back, throw them back. And something just jumped behind the boat, too. I'm going to get this guy, fortunately, I think, finally. Oh! Oh, I don't believe it. I cannot keep these fish on. That was just circle hook failure again. Ooh. Ooh. Chew in a heartbeat. Now that's a nice looking fish right there, folks. I think yeah. that's a schoolmaster. Oh, my goodness. Gorgeous. I wonder what that was. But they are nasty to eat, hard to clean, and they'll cut you so deep in a blink of an eye. Wow, I wonder what that was. Go back down so we can catch them. Oh, they're gorgeous. Okay, here we go again. Ooh, I guess he got off again. Is that a swing and a miss? Oh man, circle hook foul up again. <laughs> All right, come back for more, I guess. And if I can just keep him out of the structure now, I'd just like to see what one of these guys is. As long as it's not, not a red snapper. This has got that snapper shake, but we'll see. This is not down in the structure. Come on, come on. Come on up here. Let me see you. Oh, he's big and red and a shark just got him. A yeah. big old shark just got him. Well, at least you didn't lose a good fish. Yeah. There was a red snapper and he comes back for more. He wants the rest of them. 
How about that, folks? Play, are you? I don't want them now. <laughs> How about that, folks? Boy, they're brilliant and red out here. But this one's brilliant and dead. It's about as dead as you can get a red. This is that's a dead red. I can't keep them, but we feed them to the sharks all the time. Bye. Sorry. All right, this is a game called Beat the Shark. You catch a fish and you gotta beat him to the surface before the shark gets it. That's a red snapper. The shark didn't get him. Another circle hook failure here. <laughs> I think I got something on here. I do. Now it's it's the game. Beat the shark. Ooh, I'm in a hole. I can feel it. I'm rubbing off. I'm rubbing structure down there. Come on up. Get out of that structure. Get out of that structure. Mm -mm -mm. What do you want me to do? That's all right. Nothing. <laughs> I'm rubbing off something. Uh, beat the shark. Wow. Just a big old red snapper, I think. Yep, great big one. I got your line again. Or my line, maybe. All right. If I can get this guy off, maybe we can get your line undone. Is it mine or yours? I don't know. Whichever one, it's loose now. All right, this is a big boy. It's about a 28, 30 incher right here. 26 and a half. I'm playing conservative. 25. And yeah, I'll let him swallow that too. Boy, I tell you, that circle hook is down there. Salt the kayak. I'm busy, Robbie. Salt the kayak. Go ahead, go ahead, RB. RD. You got anything? Couple vermilion, couple black sea bass, and a ton of red snappers. I said a couple vermilion. A couple black sea bass, some Spanish mackerel, and red snapper. How about you? Now I can hear you. What did you say? <laughs> a couple black sea bass and vermilions. How about you? I ain't got a fish in a box. I'm over here at East 11. We're at the party grounds now. And we just saw a sailfish jump. You out there at the rock? Negative. Party grounds. Oh, we ain't far from me then. I'm over here at East 11. Yeah, 10-4. Uh, it was just a little bit too big of waves to go all the way out to the rock. Yeah. I think they head back a little inshore here. This current's ripping out here. I know. It is here too, everywhere we've been. Yeah, 10-4. Well, I think it's just another big old red snapper. I gotta change bait or something. Let's see him down there. Yeah, great big guy. At least there's no shark around. 
Oh. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> I know. All right, come on. That's a big one in it. He is. Heading down. Whew. Thank you, Lord. That's fun, though. So many of them That's fun. All right, well, I got a, a little bit of a break here for all this catching red snapper. I'm going to wish Connor Roberts a happy birthday. And I'm going to happy birthday to Drake and Mason. And, happy birthday. And <laughs> um, Herman Ochoa, your wife says happy Valentine's Day and ask her anything any uh, cake that you want to make, would you want her to make, or cookies that you want her to make, and she'd be glad to make them because you're such a great guy. Now this one, we need uh, all you brothers and sisters of the hook to say a prayer for the Whitlock family because their daughter, their nine-year-old daughter, was in a boating accident. So say some prayers for the Whitlock family. Nine-year-old daughter, pray, pray, pray. God can take care of all those kind of things. Or give you strength, whatever's needed. I think they lost so, her, didn't they? I don't know if they Did lost her or not. She Did she pass? she pass? Oh man, they need more I prayer. Hey, there's Myrtle too. Myrtle. Go back there behind the boat. Hey, Myrtle. Myrtle. Hello, Myrtle. How you doing, Myrtle? I see you got a Myrtle's grunt coming up. It. You got a grunt coming up. Hey, Myrtle. Myrtle Good to see you again. Goes. Good to see you again, Myrtle. All right. God bless y'all. I don't know. Big John's got here. Got something. We caught it on the way up. I got a sardine on this line. I don't got a sabiki on there, I think. Uh. What you got there, John? See it down there? Two of them or something. Two black sea bass or three? Two, three, three black sea bass, four, four black sea bass, <laughs> four of them, and at least one is a keeper. One's a keeper. Way to go, Big John. Unbelievable. Well, I had a big battle with a shark, and a shark won. Big one, big shark. Broke him off. Got my leader, got my circle hook, sinker, and everything. That's all right. And... This sardine has produced a, what do you know, rare and endangered red snapper. Doo -doo -doo. Red snapper. Put a smaller hook on because I'm trying to get into some other kind of fish. Y'all didn't see me catch this little vermilion, but he's a 13 incher in the cooler. What were you using for bait on that one? Uh, sardine. Part of sardine. Look at you. Oh my, that's a big boy too. My goodness. Oh, he's huge. I want to take this opportunity to thank Joshua Murray's for sending me a double uh, striper bass rig that I'm going to try out right here. See if I can catch some black sea bass. Thank you, Joshua. I'm going to try it out right now. <laughs> All right, Joshua. First drop down, I had two two one-half sardines on here. First drop down, let's see what we get. Yeah, let's hope this is not more red snapper. I'd love to have some black sea bass. I mean, it's almost 12 o'clock and, well, a little red snapper. A little red snapper. Oh well, it is what it is, isn't it? It is what it is. How big was that? Black sea bass you just caught? 16. Wow. Wow. That's the biggest one I've got. Okay. There's Myrtle's sister, Agnes. See her down there? Yeah. She's a big one. She's, she's keeping an eye on us here. Myrtle's sister, Agnes, right there. Hey, Agnes. I see Agnes. Hope you don't catch Agnes, John. <laughs> Later, Agnes. I know what you are. How come there are no mangroves out here? 
That needs to be Mutt. some, or muttons, yeah. Or lanes. Yeah, nothing but red snapper, and a few black sea bass, and a few vermilions. Uh oh. oh. Yeah, you got to keep them out of that shelf area. Big old red snapper. Big one. Oh well. This is what? What does Linda think about not? She's the one who doesn't want to do it anymore. Yep. It's her idea. The food pantry. She passed that on. I I made her quit that. Cause she, every time she'd oh 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 big shark big shark big shark big shark ah <laughs> almost got him almost got him <laughs> I saved this guy's life pulling him up fast enough. Yeah, she's uh, starting Bible study groups. She can't do everything. Uh, thank you, Lord. That was kind of fun.